This story is graphic in nature. The animals appearing made sure that the humans faced the ultimate challenge, getting on. Despite the misconceptions of many, there were no real jackasses in Maple Heights before this past March. Because that was when the junior class imported donkey basketball, an epic battle involving a little fun and a lot of fundraising. In the pregame meeting, the ref explained how to get the best mileage out of the donkeys, while the pooper scoopers stayed alert, ready for any stinky situations. Some of the athletes had no problem learning the rules. One of them felt right down home. Get along, Twinkie! There were tender moments of donkey and rider bonding. Robert Haley, heading to Bowling Green on a football scholarship, seemed to think that maybe he was some kind of pro at this unusual sport. Well, I just want to show the coaches that I'm uh, more than just a football player. I'm a two-sport athlete. Everyone shared his enthusiasm, but not everyone shared his skill. It was hard for some to get their partners cooperating, even when they talked things over. Believe it or not, some players actually knew the goal was to make baskets, although no scoring records were shattered. But some riders were happy just to be there and ignored the taunts of troublemakers in the crowd. Good Lord, what do these guys eat? Uh, I don't know, but they're uh, really heavy. We spotted athletic director Frank Jesse and pulled him off his mount to ask him if this was a career highlight. I think so. I've been fortunate enough to be in a lot of big ball games, high school championships, NCAA, Elite Eight, but these are the ones you dream about as a kid, going out and, you know, shoveling the snow off the, off the barnyard so you could play in front of a crowd on a donkey. I mean, this is the pinnacle. It doesn't get any better than this. So when the games wound down, the scoreboard showed that it was the juniors with a natural flair for this game. And as the genetic donkeys were being rounded up to go back to their barns, they let everyone know that they got a real kick out of this game, too.